Trisha Christie has been working for this moment for eight years. Thank you, everyone. It's a moment that no woman in Manitoba has ever experienced before. I'm honored. Christie is the first woman ever to receive a commission to be a land surveyor in Manitoba. The Association of Manitoba Land Surveyors is the oldest land surveying organization in the country, and it has never had a female member. Technology is evolving extremely fast. It's much more approachable to become a female land surveyor. Uh, the surveyors now deal with much more high-tech ways of, of doing surveys. It's much less labor-intensive. It's much more attractive. Land surveying is a career based on determining property lines, which used to involve weeks in the field doing labor-intensive work. As technology has advanced, the work has required less and less time out in the field. The information a surveyor collects is used for a variety of purposes, from small residential jobs to the biggest commercial developments. The information is a critical part of any building project. While Christie is the first female doing this work in this province, there are others across the country. The AMLS hopes other females here follow Christie's lead. It really expands um, the membership potential of our, of our profession, for one thing, and it really uh, breaks down a lot of barriers. Even though Christie is the first female land surveyor in Manitoba, that is not what drives her. What drives her is her passion for problem solving. From scouring over a 100-year-old map to map out the property lines of a building like this, to mapping out the new property lines for areas like this. You get surveys that still are original post surveys that you actually have to go into the field and find original posting that dates back 100 years ago or even more and to analyze that data that comes back and look at old field note records, that's the problem solving part. It's putting the pieces of the puzzle together to figure out where property, legal property boundaries are. As for being in a profession dominated by men, Christy doesn't mind. She's used to it, having studied in male-dominated university departments like geomatics and engineering. Whether I was the first one or not didn't really matter. I was pursuing the career regardless. I think, I hope that this will just encourage more females to go into the profession, to realize that it is something achievable. But Christy won't hold the distinction of being the lone lady in her field for long. There are a couple of other women in various stages of training to become land surveyors in Manitoba over the next couple of years. For Shaw TV, I'm Allison Hall.